Hi, I'm Bill McLaughlin, Editor-in-Chief of Furniture Today. I'm here in the ICO showroom with the always fashionably dressed Michael Amini and the always lovely Jane Seymour. And we are in an entirely new, revamped, re-energized showroom. Thank you for being here. We are so proud of uh, these new introductions that uh, we have launched almost a year ago. What Michael's done so brilliantly is he's, he's taken the old and the new and it's modern at the same time as it's got a classic feel, a kind of a deco feel, but it's very, um, it's very much today. I think what's really exciting is that anyone who walks in here, whether it's a retailer or a, or a customer, they go, this is my home. Well, this, this whole uh, collection or series of collections has evolved so much since the two of you started collaborating. When we first started, you know, it was, we really thought out of the box and did something radically different when we did the Hollywood Swank. And that's still selling like crazy and, you know, it's, it's obviously the whole bling thing and Hollywood and glam is great. But I kept saying to Michael, I said, oh, Michael, I, you know, I, I want something that's really chic and elegant, you know, like, like when you're on those ocean liners, you know, in the 40s, something that's kind of art deco-y, but at the same time modern. I'm, I'm really excited by this. I, I think it's just such a, a kind palette to the eye. You can take it to the beach, like I am, in my home, and you can take it, you can take it uptown. You can take it anywhere. And we have another wonderful group is coming for next April market, it's called Juliet. And that's absolutely magnificent as well. But we're expanding all these collections. Uh, we are coming up for the next market with home office and vanities for bathrooms with beautiful slumped uh, sinks that coordinates with the color of the marble and the color of the furniture. Jane, you just mentioned that you're redoing your home. Yes. Everybody wants to know what stars have in their homes. <laughs> yes. So, <laughs> what did you put in? Well, I'm putting uh, the London bed in uh, my master bedroom. And it's interesting because it's quite kind of dramatic and ornate with all the different pieces, but I'm right by the ocean. So I'm taking the bed and I'm doing something different with it. I'm going to show how you can put that bed in a different kind of an environment. Um, to me, that headboard also speaks to a shell. And I have a beautiful um, bathroom that I've just redone with honed um, white marble. And it, it's got, it looks like sea foam. So the whole idea of the indoor outdoor will be there. And then in the two of my guest bedrooms, I'm going to put the Paris Chic. I couldn't decide between the two beds, so I'm going to do both. And uh, when you can't yeah. decide, yes, <laughs> it is when you can't decide, okay. buy both. That's <laughs> why we have two beds or three for each collection because it creates conversation. Yes, it's funny because when you uh, look at the consumer looking at it, they sort of like, honey, which one do you like? So it's not a matter of should we get it or not, which one do you like? Yeah, for example, in my home. The, the rooms are going in actually has a slightly vaulted ceiling. So the one that has the angles is absolutely perfect. But I really kind of like that, that uh, you know, the traditional the kind gondola. of- The gondola. The gondola thing too. So uh, I'm, I'm excited to see. Plus those were the rooms the twins used to live in. And I like the fact that they're masculine and feminine at the same time. So we have broken news here today. Coming in April, home office and vanities. And now you know what Jane has in her bedroom. 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 <laughs> Thank you both. Thank, Thank you. you.